Triple. Attention. Not long ago, 114 students had nowhere to study. It was February and March. There was a strong wind followed by heavy rain. To our big surprise, when we woke up, the school collapsed. Then, a new kind of building project took shape in the western Ivory Coast region of Sakasu. UNICEF found me and said they'd heard of our difficulties and said they'd come out and build three classes for the children in our community with plastic bricks. I laughed. Far from a joke, UNICEF partnered with a Colombian company called Conceptos Plasticos, or Plastic Concepts. These classrooms are pretty strong, they are safe, they are water retardant, they are fire retardant, they are water resistant, and they as well last a longer period compared to normal traditional classrooms. The building project takes discarded plastics and turns them into construction-grade bricks. Plastic buildings? Okay, let's wait and see. And later on, the school just came out of the earth. I'm a living witness. That has given us hope. The project may give hope to thousands of other children in Ivory Coast. Conceptos Plasticos is constructing an in-country factory to convert even more plastic into bricks. Before we had bad construction, UNICEF came to build us this building. We like it. UNICEF says Yamsokro, the capital city, produces more than 280 metric tons of plastic every day and recycles only about 5% of that. The Plastic Brick Project aims to build schools for more than 25,000 children and give jobs to women in low-income neighborhoods. Arash Arabasadi, VOA News, Washington.